Hi, uh, it's Joe. Today I'm going to be machining the piston valve for the Sirius steam engine. And I'm actually machining the slot in it. Here's the, like its baby brother, the, the Stuart Sir Turner son. And this eccentric shaft drives the banjo, which moves the uh, piston valve via a slot in it. And it's that slot I'm going to be milling today for the series. So hopefully uh, this little machine's up to cutting the stainless steel. I think it's, in fact I'm sure it's 303 stainless so it shouldn't be too bad. But uh, I'll move the camera around where you can see a little better and we'll get started. Okay, I got the Atlas set in back gear to run uh, 101 RPM with this two and a half inch cutter. And uh, I've already set the position of the cutter for it to put the slot in the center of the valve. I've touched off the end. And for this first path, I, I think I'm just going to take about 25 thousandths of an inch and just hear what it sounds like. May be able to take significantly more than that, but we'll see. I guess I ought to put my safety glasses on. Actually sounded pretty good. I think I'll try and take a hundred, see what that sounds like.
sounds like that 100,000 step to cut is going to work great. And I'm kind of surprised, frankly. This machine's about 100 years old. Or at least five or six decades. <laughs> Machines equipped with power feed on the X axis on the table. I wish I could have set this up to use that instead of having to crank up the knee to do this cutting. Well, yeah, that sounded great. I'm going to take another hundred. I bought a South Bend lathe, a nice South Bend lathe, maybe 10 years ago, from the father of the man I worked with. And when I went over to get the lathe, he had this little mill sitting over in the corner. And it looked kind of like a model of a milling machine, kind of like a toy. But it was neat looking, even though it was real dirty at the time. So I bought it, and it turns out I, I use this thing all the time. Well, I got another 400, 500 thousandths to take out of there. So uh, I'll come back uh, for the finish pass. Okay, I'm ready for the final pass. Then I take 25 on the final pass. Let me zoom in a little. Okay. 25.
right. Well, I'll remove it from the vise and clean it off and we'll have a look at it. I well, got it off the machine. Blew it off, deburred it a little bit. Really looks good. I don't know if this will show up or not, but looks fine. I'm happy. So, till next time.